All right, well, there you go. From the time that those ass pulled in to the back of my spot to the time that I am packed up and moving is just about an hour. So I'm out of here. I have no patience for those who have no common courtesy and no campers etiquette. This has happened before in that spot. It's a very big spot and a lot of folks will park there to go hiking up or to go climbing up in a spot. And apparently there's some climbing app that tells them that that is the parking lot um, to access that area. And apparently this group of guys is going to camp. They're gonna camp up there and they took all of their gear up there and uh, they're also going to climb. So cool, but you don't have to park in my camp spot. There's actually quite a few people out here that I'm passing now on the way out. So I think that it's a good idea for me to leave. I normally don't necessarily give in right away. Um, I will wait a while, especially if they're just gonna park there. I would have rather they ask me like, hey, we have to get up there and we would like to park the cars down here. Could you let me know what you're comfortable with since you're already camping right here? Like that would have been a complete great conversation. I would have actually then told them that I was leaving and they could park where the trailer was or whatever. But the fact that they didn't even acknowledge, didn't say hello, didn't nothing. They just parked that close to the back of the trailer and then pulled in, almost touched me with their bumper as they were trying to turn around to park on the side of the road. Like done, game over. I stood there staring at them and uh, there was no response. <laughs> and so, I don't know. I guess maybe I should have said, hello, like what the hell are you doing? But I wanted to try to be cool and collected. I didn't want to be confrontational. We're all out in the middle of the woods to do the same thing. We're all out here camping, but I'm not out here to have neighbors. Apparently they are. <laughs> so, so that's that. Absolutely crazy to me. I'm super curious as to, oh my gosh, cutest dogs. Um, super curious as to what your camping etiquette rules are. Um, I think a fair distance away from folks is cordial. And a fair distance meaning, I don't wanna see the whites of your eyes. I don't want to hear if you pass gas in the middle of the night. I don't want to hear if you belch. Um, so that being said, I would say 50 feet, like half a football field away from each other is, is fair. And I think that your rig needs to be even further. Like the edge of what I would call your campsite and my campsite need to be like 50 feet away from each other. So that's my thought. That's 40 plus years of camping and camping with folks that never seem to step on toes. I grew up around folks that were extremely classy and cordial when it came to camping. They weren't wilding out. They weren't trashing the grounds, like none of that. So you tell me what you think. Okay, we'll see you next time.